All right, guys, so Shoddy T here with the, I guess, a daily grind of Battlegrounds. I guess when this becomes a real thing, I, I'm debating if I should do this, these streams daily or probably every other day, like three to four times a week. But since it's in beta, it's only a few more days left. We'll do a recording today, probably tomorrow. I think it in Wednesday, which I'll be at work. But uh, we got on a little winning streak there. We got down as low as uh, after we beat the Mad Titan. We ran into a gauntlet. We went all the way down to 1666. There was a couple of mods in there. And then we got on a, a winning streak. We get to just beat a family member. So when did I face the Mad Titan? So after I faced the Titan, I got four straight losses. And then got two straight wins and two straight losses again. So it was like a lot of losses. So it was like five losses in the seven stretch. We well, actually uh, nine losses in a, um, I guess, yeah. Anyway, you do the math. And then after that, one, nine, in the last 10, um, which this being a pretty tough matchup. It was close, but I was just outmatched there. But yeah, so. Now we're in, I think we're getting close to our personal best rating. I think we were at 1796. That's the highest we've ever been. I think I, I might have been in the 1800s when we were doing it the first iteration of Battlegrounds. But the highest I've been in this second segment with the safeguard was 1796. And we're, we're 141, so it's a lot of... I was told in there that the top 100 is flooded with... Um, mods so if I keep winning I'm probably gonna run into some mods because there's a mod that's ranked number three right now if you see that leaderboard to your right because I highlighted this guy before yeah this guy here has a two hundred and fifty thousand dollar rating but anyway about to go into a match so I'm gonna look at that later uh quackadilly blip interesting name okay all right, we're gonna take away your tiger. And what I've been doing lately, I just been taking away who I perceive to be someone's best attacker. Cause I'm almost to the point where I don't really care who you put out on defense. Now, obviously, there are some people I prefer not to face. Um, but after I do that, then I'll ban. Yes, yeah, so I think I got his two best attackers out of the way, so I can ban Penny Parker now. I actually don't mind facing Penny now. Um, but you prefer not to have to face it if you don't need to. All right, so I gotta make sure I have a habit counter eventually. All right, so we'll do these two to be safe. Just to see what he does. I'm pretty sure he's gonna pick Archangel. I'll make sure not to put a lot of Archangel food out there. All right, uh. Why not? I kind of want to have to re-roll because this doesn't count, so. Uh, let's see. What's he going to do for me there? I need somebody for that Dr. Doom, too. I need somebody for Dr. Doom. I need somebody for Havoc. I've seen someone take down my Havoc with Apocalypse, so we'll see. Somebody else does the same. I'll put Doom out there. That's, even, that's still a tough fight for Archangel. And that's the route he goes. I mean, because you have to get Lake with RNG, but if you don't get him down before that SP1, Gonna be taking a lot of block damage and a lot of missing dispersion you're gonna be facing. Uh, still don't have anybody for Dr. Doom. But I got somebody for Havoc potentially. Let's put him out here. I 
didn't get the best roll there, but just got to work with the hand you're dealt. No skill champs, but I got, well, I think it's going to put Havoc out there. All right, let's 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 try to win this first one. So we'll put Mysterio out there. Don't want to give him Archangel food just yet. I want to try to win this one first. All right, that may work. So this is all about the RNG. If I can get the armor up, I should be fine. If I don't, then I will take a lot of plasma damage. So, luck of the draw here. <laughs> well, I think we got armor. <laughs> I think we got armor. I would love to see some variety there. this okay could have been quicker if he didn't throw so many sp ones but Mysterio is a pretty tough defender. I wasn't sure about the matchup because I don't fight with Mr. Negative and know what he interacts with, good or not. Anyways. Um why not? Let's put Apocalypse out there. Make him he's gonna I don't know who he's gonna have for that guy. Dr. Doom on defense, okay. Uh, could I get by? No, I need, I need to save Kingpin. Uh, this would be a meme matchup. This matchup is doable, but I just, I got him in a checkmate situation. Yeah, I figured he had to go with Ultron. So I should win this. Not this round, definitely next round. Because I got an idea what I'm going to do here. Because what I'm going to do is that I'm going to intentionally take some shock damage. And he's going to get murked. I actually I don't even mind taking damage to the um, block on SB2. Sick doom. I have I need 
they get not one shot on me, dude. Cause I don't want to get shot from a medium attack. I want to get shot from the door. He stole my power. Wow. That's right. This SP2 is unblockable. Uh, with the aura active, that's a new mistake. I mean, this is a mean matchup anyway. I mean, I, I could have played it better for sure. But now I get shock damage. See how much plasma damage he's taking when I'm shocked. That's the reason why I did that. A little too late for that though. I wish, I wish I got shocked earlier. That's not a bad fight though. I could have done better. Gosh, I could have won if I played better. But he's in checkmate. So, because I got Kingpin for a mortal abomination. If that's what he's going to put on defense. Um, I'll see what he has for Thing. But I'm definitely not, I'm not giving him anybody for Archangel. Forget about that. Yeah, that may work. I mean, this Kingpin, or not Kingpin, thing is not immune to poison. Now, he may run into some trouble potentially with the rock stacks, so we'll see. And the protection, so we'll see. If I play my A game, I should finish this fight with pretty good health. Purposely trying not to have him throw his SP1 so I don't have to worry about the uh, hatred buildup. Gotta go with it. Bottom to the wall at that point. Yeah. He's not finishing with perfect health. Get the best deck, but we work with it. I love it when they can get Archangel early so I can play in my defense right afterwards. Like, what sucks sometimes when they have that last pick, like, after, like if you get seven and they got six and they got one more draft to make, and you saw at that point, okay, no Archangel, no torch, let me get somebody out there, and then Archangel shows up. And this happened at times. Yeah, the draft can play a factor in wins and losses for sure. Um, all right, so we're almost at our high. We're at 17.95. We're one short. I don't recall how high I got in the previous uh, round a month ago. Now, I remember facing this guy last month. I think I fought him six times, and we were three and three. And his roster has improved since then. Let's take away Omega Sentinel. Ah, uh, man. Take away Weapon X. Um, hmm. It's one of these pick your poison type things. I think his torch is higher than mine. There's no point of trying to have a torch battle if he has a bigger torch. Oh, well, he banned mine anyway. That's okay. Uh, 
guess I should have banned a little better. Um, yeah, we're gonna play it safe early on. But man, knows he got a bunch of attackers in that group. Like I said, I can't ban everybody. All of those can finish fights quick, especially Nebula and Hyperion. And Diablo in the right matchup. Kingpin in the right matchup. Oh boy. Well, we gotta put, oh, if I put things, gonna put Kingpin. Oh boy, this is not good. Uh, I have a fighting chance, though. I mean, the fight ain't super quick, but so far this isn't looking good. This is looking good. Put Cersei on defense for good measure and Nick Fury. I wouldn't be surprised. Or Apocalypse. You know, either one of those two or the three. I don't mind facing Cersei though if you put Cersei out there. So if, if I were him, I'd put Apocalypse and Nick Fury. Let's see what he does. Okay, that's fine. Alright, we got somebody for Cersei, but not who I prefer. Alright, so right now he only has one counter for my mystics so um, you can only use nebula for one person uh, there we go penny parker i have nobody for her i was hoping not to see her in the rotation because i already know i'm at a disadvantage I'm not gonna play this. I'm not gonna play this here. Oh, now I get somebody for Cersei. I better late than never. Cersei's probably not gonna put her out there now. Um, he's gonna put Doom on defense. Gonna put Pete Parker, okay. Um, I don't know, man. Let's put Sasquatch. I mean, I'm pretty sure he's gonna put, put uh, Nebula out there. I'd rather just see her get out of the way. You have to put Nebula right, yeah. We're trying to strategize, so let's throw this match away. Um, let's just throw this match away. I don't care about this match up here. We're gonna throw this match up away. But we're gonna try to, we're not gonna just intentionally die because he could mess up. But um, it's not likely. Fury's up. Make him not take as long to get rid of his stacks and his um, spider charges, shield, whatever.
<laughs> I know I lost a long time ago. Oh, we actually timed out. Hmm. Interesting. Didn't anticipate that. Probably could have won that if I put some more damage over time out there. But I honestly thought I wasn't going to win that. Um. Okay. Are you gonna put Doom out there, sir, or Nick Fury? Which one? Doom or Nick Fury? Bold man. Why are you trying to put me in a checkmate situation, sir? Um. I mean, I got viable fighters in round three. Okay. I can see that working. Let's build up to the S. Let's get the poison. Then we'll go with the, the generation. because that could potentially bypass the uh, safeguard, I think. Don't do this. Please don't do this, man. Come on, AI. Come on, throw the special. Pushing out there, see if it does bypass. Doesn't look like it. I think the damage cap is 1704. All the hits are 1704. too passive man I could have I could have been in there I guess that's another factor too is AI so we got the the roster the deck the AI for skill all those factor into the matrix of effectiveness um, it's probably other factors too but this is the last um, stream here. And we just got enough energy just to do it. We've already claimed all the milestones right now. It's just for experimental purposes. And what I may do tomorrow, I may shuffle my deck. Because uh, obviously the ranking doesn't matter. But I want to try certain matchups. Um, um, I may bring Kitty Pride. In there because by the time we get here again now that I have that gold I'm gonna send her to rank three I'm gonna awaken her put her at a decent sick level with those generic six stones I have and put her on my battleground roster so just to give somebody another target to ban so that way I can use some of my better attackers and then probably make some rank two, rank three decisions 
um, while I have all these resources from this past weekend. But let's go back to this here. I know we talked about this. So this guy, 259,000 uh, rating. All right, just for reference, comparison. Now this person, I mean, I can't accuse them of anything, but that's what you should expect. You got KT1, this guy is a modder. He modded the heck out of me. It doesn't look like it, but trust me, I I got modded when I face him. He doesn't he doesn't have to mod, but some of these people just mod just for the heck of it. Um, here's another one. Seriously, guys, here's the forty two thousand, and he did the abyss. <laughs> I mean, he, he, I mean it's possible to do the abyss with unit man, but. He's probably cheated at arenas to get a bunch of units, too. I don't know tell him what these guys have done. I remember facing Happy McMuffins. Uh, that was a close matchup. Uh, we got some family members there. Oh, this is another person that modded me, Lady Avenger. Uh, but anyway, um, that was tough. Uh, I think I faced this guy before. I don't remember the outcome. I just remember that alliance tag. Uh, looks like it's another pick or poison. Looks like I'm gonna have to ban those first two people off rip. The skilled tiger fighters can mow down fights, seriously. Um, let's see, you got Hyperion I can ban. That's man, Iron Man if it's because for certain. There are only a handful of counters for him that are quick. So let's go Apocalypse. Apocalypse there. He's got some defender options there. I don't mind facing either one of them. Yeah, I figured he was gonna go off this defense. All right, let's put Havoc Bait out there, see what he does with that. And why not go with Falcon? All right, he's gonna pick Warlock. Probably Bishop or um, the Mortal Abomination. There we go. All right, so he has Warlock. Uh, do I still have a... A better preferred counter. All right, let's uh, guess we'll just in case he puts out here no defense. We'll go with her. I doubt he has no defense, but you never know. All right, you got Nick Fury. Still don't have the enemy mock preferred counter. I have to just roll what I got. Let's, let's re roll since it's the last one. Let's re roll. Hope we get a good roll. Nope. Oh, we just saw somebody just crush my guy. Well, I'm glad I didn't put a lot of bleeders out there. I'm always wary of. Just talked about that the last round. Put someone out there. Let's put our best defender out there. See what he does. All right, Nick Fury. Do I have poison immune champs? Oh, man, I may have to go with um. But since this habit counter is already out there, might as well. Um, We'll try it. Ebony ball all fix. Okay. I can see it. Yes, I'm gonna do my best tonight. I'm gonna try to 
try to have as much health as possible. Cause he's gonna take a lot of block damage from Apocalypse. We uh, see if we can get him down to one percent. All right, that's okay. Again, if I had more health, I would have won that one. Gotta be clean, man. Be clean. That's the commercial, right? That was my best defender, too, so now I'm in trouble. Because he has Archangel. And I don't have enough anti Archangels out there. I just don't. Yeah. I don't have enough anti-archangels out there. And he pet that quick. Like he said, yeah, I know I got you, buddy. I got you. Okay. If I won that first round, I would have had a better chance. But it's over. best light possible. I don't 
think I got Black Widow on either one of these draws. I definitely not. I need to step up my attack team. Um, so when you get up here, you have to be able to finish fights quicker. That's just the bottom line. So. so here we go. I got up to 17.95 and lost two straight. So, but amongst my friends, I think I finally passed the Mad Titan. Let's see where we are. Kabam doesn't want to show. Come on, show us. Show the audience. They don't want to show anything. Okay. Oh, the problem's connecting to your network. Well, that pretty much sums up this. There's been a lot of glitches for sure. But there we go. All right. So most of my friends were number one. So we, Mad Titans made some strides though. And then in our alliance, Nick, he's coming up. We may, may check me out on his live stream tomorrow. He said he has a live stream tomorrow, 1130 Eastern time. So stay tuned. We may face off. So anyway, guys, I uh, hope you enjoyed that video. Like, share, comment below, subscribe, and hit that bell notification.